Hi guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can start your WebEx meeting and how can you share good quality audio and video from your host computer to the participant's computer. So let's get started. The first thing you're going to do, is, of course, is start your meeting. And once you start your meeting at the bottom, you're going to see all these options. And one of the options is share content. Now, before you share your content, make sure you launch the content. In my case, I've already launched a PowerPoint. And I'm going to go ahead and share that PowerPoint. So here, I'm going to go ahead and uh, click on share. But before I click on share, the first thing you need to do is on the top side, you're going to see this drop down menu says optimize for text and image. So if you click on that, you're going to get two more options you know so at the bottom side this is the option that we're gonna select optimize for motion and video and you wanna click on share and it's possible that once you click on optimize for motion and video from the drop down you may get you know to install drivers and things like that and I did I didn't get it in my case you know because I already have those drivers installed but it's a possibility that you may get that uh, you know option to install it so uh, here is some information on the info tab you know you can read it if you really want to but I already selected, make sure you select on the second one and install any drivers or anything that it may ask you to do that. And then you can go ahead and share your content. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on share and now it's gonna launch, now it's gonna launch my PowerPoint. And this is the PowerPoint that I'm sharing which I already have an audio file. On the top side, you're gonna see this orange, you know, it says oh, you are sharing Microsoft PowerPoint. Uh, you don't have to play around with any other settings. You know, once you have it launched, you know, you can go ahead and, uh, you know, put in presentation mode if you want audio to be played. In my case, if I do put in presentation mode, the audio automatically starts playing. Um, you know, you can also play the audio manually by clicking on that plus sign, on the play sign. You know, so if I click on this, you know, it's going to start playing my audio. And from here onwards, the audio is going to play on the host computer. And it's also going to start playing on the participant's computer. And the quality of the audio that I'm playing on the participant's computer is almost the same as on the host computer. And that is... That is what you gain by doing or playing around with this setting, you know, that you're getting the exact same quality of the audio file um, that you're playing on the host computer. You're getting the exact same quality on the participant's computer. doesn't matter what location they're on. So even if you have a video file that you're playing, it's going to be almost the same quality on the participant's computer that you'll be seeing on the host computer. So this is the benefit, guys. You know, I just wanted to share this with you guys. And hopefully this video helps you guys share your content uh, if you're doing a WebEx meeting and uh, share the exact same audio quality or video quality. So hopefully it helps you guys. Guys, if you like the video, please subscribe to my channel and like the video. Thank you.